I, you know, as, as well um, knowledgeable as you are, you, you might find it actually a little bit of humor and all this sadness. Um, what about, uh, there's an Irish person that originates uh, from Ireland. His name is uh, Michael Tessarian. Uh, he runs yeah. with uh, Gordon Maxwell. What do you what do you know about him? Uh, uh, yeah, well, I'll, I'll just say oh, this. Oh, he's out there. I mean, he's I'll, out I'll there. Just say I'd this. love to I'll know just, what you I'll think. I'll just say this about these people. Um, they all know each other very well. 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 They all come out with intelligence, which is truth. But then they always tack on the same endings to it, which throws you off into outer space, which okay. is counterintelligence as far as I view it. That's my opinion, right? Mm -hmm. And uh, um, uh, when people want to find truth, you must be very careful what you let in, because you are the guard of your own mind. And it can be very persuasive, and often they come out, too, with what seems to be certain information for the first time. Uh, that's what generally grabs people. But they all know each other. Um, um, I can't tell you too much, actually, about this. But, I mean, I've had offers to go along with certain things where I'd be heavily financed, guaranteed best-selling books and so on, if I would just go along with the usual conspiracy stuff and, and bring in the alien agenda at the end. And I've, I've refused it. Mm, I see. I see. Okay. So, some. So, what you're saying is that you. What you're saying in many, in several cases, is not what people really want to hear. That people do. Do people want to hear the truth or not? The real truth. And they'll want to hear it, but uh, you. You have professional people out there uh, that can that can start off the right way, which I see is intelligence. But then, they'll, why spin it off into something you could never alter? If, if, this, if this was aliens, for instance, right? Uh, mm -hmm. Then find an alien so they can complain and change things, because that will never happen. Which means that you leave the politicians and the social activism alone. What's the point if aliens are doing it, right? Right. And it's the same I thing. If, it, if it's written in the stars, then it's predictive programming. It's fate. There's nothing you can do. What about... Um do you, uh, David Icke, well, of course, <laughs> this is the person that comes to mind when you say the, the alien thing. So uh, you feel that um, he basically, um, okay, I get it. I don't have to say it out loud, but he basically ended with the alien conclusion. Well, first you grab your audience, you, you get the fans, and then you spin it. That's mm -hmm. why I've seen over the years with different ones. And 20 years ago, a set, one man was set out to start the foundations that they all build on top with his own special interpretations of the Sumerian tablets, which is absolute nonsense. We'll be right back, Alan. We've got to take a short break. We'll end up this hour. Thank you very much. Yeah.